So I thought I'd make this video because I had an unexpected situation where without intending to, I landed up losing about 20 kilograms, which is about 45 pounds in a year. I wasn't actually intending to lose weight. The strange thing is that I landed up going to the doctor for a checkup a year after I made a lifestyle change, which was unrelated to trying to lose weight or anything like that. And the doctor got a surprise when he put me on the scale and he noticed that my weight had dropped so much since I'd been there a year before. So I was quite surprised to discover that in one year, without intending to, without trying, I'd actually lost that amount of weight. It's unbelievable, in fact. And um, a lot of people I know are constantly taking diets, buying expensive supplements, and doing all kinds of things to try and lose weight. As we all know, invariably, these diets tend not to work. Maybe you will lose a little bit of weight in the first couple of weeks or whatever. But you go through a lot of stress, you maybe spend a lot of money buying all kinds of products that people are marketing with the promise that it's going to get you to lose weight. I accidentally stumbled upon a way of losing a lot of weight, but in a natural way, without any cost at all. Not only without any cost, it actually would save money. It might sound too good to be true, but it is true. And I'll give more information in, the, in another video that I'm going to make. Um, if you're interested to find out um, what I did, and I will show you um, photographs of myself from the days before I lost the weight, and, and some photos from after I lost the weight, so that you can see the significant difference. I'll just say this before I end this particular video, is that many years ago I had a couple of friends who were a little concerned about me because I was a little overweight and when I went jogging with them I didn't perform very well and I was having some difficulty keeping up with the other guys. And they got me to go to a sports science institute where I did some physical track work with the heart rate monitor around my wrist after which the doctor examined me looked at the results and basically told me that I was obese now I got a huge shock because I wasn't like you know rolling with fat over my belt or anything like that I didn't regard myself as being particularly overweight. I mean, I knew I was a bit overweight, but I didn't regard myself as being anything like uh, what the word obese would conjure up. So I was almost insulted when he told me that I was obese. But um, that, that's the reality. You know, with the body mass index, they work out what your weight should be ideally according to your height and your age and so on and uh, with that formula he told me with no uncertainty that I was obese. Fact is I didn't do anything really about it at that time and that was many years ago but by chance a few years ago I embarked on a course of behavior changing my routines and my patterns for some completely different purpose. It wasn't actually designed with the objective of losing weight. I won't go into it more now, but what I can say to you is that I believe that there's no doubt if you're interested in saving weight, if you are overweight, if you are maybe even what would be termed obese, 
and you're concerned about your physical well-being, especially in this time of COVID, where apparently obesity increases the risk of serious illness or death, it's probably not a bad idea to look at ways and means of reducing your weight. And yes, you can go out there and buy lots of products and, and starve yourself and do all kinds of things. And maybe you'll have some success, but invariably, from what I've read and heard, people who do go on these diets, after a while, find it very difficult to stay on them. They go back to their old habits and the weight comes back on. So there's no real permanent change of one state of health. So, I'm going to say uh, cheers for now. If you're interested, uh, please click subscribe underneath this video. And I'll be sure to let you know when I make another video giving you more information about um, how I did in fact lose that amount of weight without any real pain whatsoever. And I am also in the process of writing an ebook about it, uh, which I hope to finish uh, shortly and publish um, in the next couple of months. So I'd be happy to share uh, more information with you if you, um, if you click on subscribe and then I will notify you when the next video comes out. Uh, thanks for watching. Cheers.